guys welcome or welcome back to my channel I am Diamond Dominique and today I'm going to be doing my nails on camera so these are the nails that I am choosing to do and wait before you decide to click out this video hear me out you saw the thumbnail okay so um we're actually about to like really really dress up these um press on nails the length is long, <laughs> um, and these are actually like the new KISS um, Gel Fantasy High Volume Gel nails, and they're the sculpted nails into the coffin shape, and they're supposed to last up to seven days. I have not done press on nails in forever, so I've been going to the um, nail salon every time I want my nails done, but since this whole pandemic is going around um I decided to buy some press on nails because I literally had to take off my other nails because they were just growing out too much so I just decided to buy some press on nails and do them at home I bought this today because I just thought of this idea I wanted to put some rhinestones on um my nails and I know these are just like the craft ones um, there actually are like rhinestone nails that rhinestones that you can get for nails online, but I don't have like a beauty supply store that's open that I can go to to get those. So I have to deal with these. Um, also, I do sculpt. I do sculpt my nails, even though these are already sculpted. Sometimes they're too big, or you know, so I just sculpt them down a little bit. I cut them, trim, whatever I need to do to sculpt them to fit my nails so that they don't look like they're on top of my skin because you know with press-ons they come too big and they look like they're on top of your skin so I do like to sculpt mine and I do um, put my own clear coat on so that it can have that little salon effect and yeah so we're just going to dress these up and without further ado let's get right into this video Okay, so first we're going to start off by trying to put the rhinestones on. So here's the rhinestones right here. And this is just one that I did before I started. If it'll focus. It's not going to focus. But yeah. That's just how that looks. Uh, so I think I'm going to just play around with the rhinestones and how I want them. Oh, also I, I mentioned earlier that I found mine down. So just to make sure that they fit. So I'm also going to do that as well. Okay, so I found the ones that fit my hands so far, so I'm just going to start putting the little rhinestones on. What are these actually called? They're just called petite gems. But I'm just going to start putting these on how I want them. Um, I already know how I want them to look on my hands, so I'm just going to place them wherever I want them. So these over here are for my left hand, and you can't see these, they're not in frame, but those are for my right hand and I am left handed so if my right hand looks well my left hand looks a little bit messed up that's why so I'm gonna put one more on this one and then I'm gonna be done done this is my thumb one
Okay, now the next thing I'm going to do is put a clear coat on. Um, this is just so they'll have like the shine that usually happens whenever you first get them done at the nail salon. You really don't have to do this part. I just wanted to do this part because it's good for pictures. So don't worry about this. Alright y'all, so this is the finished product of my nails. Um, I'm just going to let them sit here and dry for a little while. I think they look pretty good. I hope they look even better on. But yeah, I'm just going to let them dry for a little while and then pop these babies on. And then I will give you guys the pictures afterwards. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe to my channel for more and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.